Hey everybody, it's Valerie here. Greetings one and all, greetings one and all. Have you been thinking about just how simple or how more simplified or simpler things were maybe about 20, 24 months ago? Well, one of the, it used to be a real joy to actually see the Facebook memories that would come up on my feed. I'd be like, oh, gee, I remember when that happened. But the last couple of days, it's been a little bit painful to see the memories, particularly when I'm looking back at memories from three years, four years ago of uh, you know, whether it's pictures of us on holiday, um, us visiting friends, having family gatherings, just things that when I look at them, I'm like, I don't even think that those days would be interrupted. And it's been really hard, actually. I've noticed that I've not actually been on my personal page because personal profile because I know that those memories are going to be there and they're just going to pop up on me and I'm going to be like, ah. Oh. Now, the other thing that comes from with that as well is looking at the kinds of conversations I may have had with people on those memories or during that time and just thinking how much more connected I was to be able to go for a spontaneous walk with someone or just you know one of my favorite things to do is to just rock up at some random cafe put a post out on Facebook and just say anybody in the area and be pleasantly surprised or not but you could do that and there's like a real yearning every time I look at that, that like, oh, if only we could recover those days. Incidentally, my husband and I caught the first pilot of Star Trek a couple of nights ago, the very first pilot, like the one like from the 60s. And my goodness, it was so awful. It was so boring. I just couldn't watch it. I was like fast forwarding it. And we are big Star Trek fans, mind you, even of the original. But the pilot was so, so boring. And here's the other thing. Even as we progressed to the, the other episodes and it got much better in terms of the acting, do you know what I realized? It hadn't really occurred to me just how objectified females were made in that series. It never ever really stood out to me when I used to watch it as a kid or as a young person. But watching it now myself with uh, uh, children, not just about my daughter, but just even with my son, just watching the way that women were really, really ugh, portrayed and used uh, in the early series is really quite off-putting and very, very hard to wade through. And maybe reflect on how we can often think about the simpler things of how much more simple things were in the past or how much more better things were in the past. If only we could go back and then I realized that, you know what? That's just my brain pining for an illusion because the years of the past came with its own complications. Two years ago, our health was horrible. I hadn't realized just how bad my asthma was and I wasn't on a preventer and for the last you know prior to that two three years from that every winter was a real drag for me and I do these lives about how I was just feeling like you know my body was breaking down and exercise being compromised and all of that and really all I needed was a preventer a few years ago um you know I had really didn't have the kinds of connections that I've made in the last 12 months incredible connections like literally just around my corner bumping into someone and going hey I've been thinking about you and then reviving that connection so I realized that when we are in this situation and we are right now in Australia most of us are uh, dealing with the COVID-19 Delta strain lockdown and we can pine for the days where we think it was simpler. But really, if we were to go back 12 months, 24 months, 36 months ago, we probably would have, we've, we've forgotten that we were in the middle of things that probably have resolved now, but were at the time also complicated and difficult. Here's what I suggest. Let's not head for, not, not try to pine for the things that, you know, time when life was simpler. Let's just keep things simple. <laughs> right here right now today 
in this next hour. Let's just keep things simple. For me, if I've noticed that the memories are kind of a triggering thing, I don't have to look at them. I really don't have to look at them. Let's keep it simple. If I start to really complicate, you know, oh, I've got a, you know, how do I keep productive? How do I make sure that I keep my exercise going while we're in lockdown? Well, let's just simplify it. <laughs> I've been on three walks today. Uh, the kids are telling me, Mom, what on earth are you doing? Three walks. Well, do you know what? There were three key relationships that I really want to keep going. One was with my best friend. One was with my son. One was with my husband. I just wanted to do it. Why not? It's really simple. You can exercise and you can walk. Let's keep it simple. Head for just the simple things, just what you can do, what you can see right in front of you. Dig deep into, you know, what's giving you a sense of peace, perspective, and joy. Anchor there. If it means that you're looking at domain real estate, that's what I did today, just looking at real estate. I'm curious. I'm just wondering what's happening in the world of property lately. You know, then I jumped onto Airbnb, like who's actually renting these things out? You know, if you have a curiosity, follow it. If you have a craft that you're really into, do it. If you've got a snack that you've been hankering after, do it. Hey, the other day I gifted Uber Eats to my mom and dad, whom I, I can't see at the moment, who, you know, live somewhere else. I Uber Eats gifted them. That was a buzz. Never done that before. I had no clue how it was going to turn out. No idea. Wrong move. I, I gave them an Uber Eats gift of ice cream, like waffles and ice cream. And then I thought, maybe this is a really bad idea. Like, will they actually? That's okay. Keep it simple. We don't have to have the answers. We don't have to know what we're doing tomorrow. We don't even have to really know what we're doing in the next hour because we're spending the weekend basically in lockdown. That's okay. Don't pine for the life that was simpler because it probably wasn't. Just head for the life today and keep it simple. Good night, everyone. Okay.